hello everybody welcome to the video i'm og sparks if you don't know me i'm the ceo of punchline records a producer mixing and mastering engineer today we are going to mix an afrobeat song and this song is titled peace of mind by sidon so let's get straight into the action intro back to the video let's jump straight to the action okay so what i do first is i this is my um template my vocal mixing template for um any any kind of song so i put my beat on top and um uh, always make sure your beat is uh, minus 6 db minus 6 db so that you can get the vocals well when you are recording and all that so with my vocal takes as in the vocal channels i only put um the auto tune which is um uh, atria antrias auto tune and i put my speed to six depending on this particular artist um so you you check your auto tune speed depending on the artist that is recording then i also have the c1 gate so the c1 gate blocks the background noise all this background noise in the studio and all that from um, entering um, into the project okay so i route all my vocal takes which is the vocals the ad leaves the harmonies and everything into the lead vocal group so the lead vocal group um, i'm muting um i'm bypassing all the um, plugins and the um, effects i'm using so that we start the mixing from scratch yes so basically i have a mixing a vocal mixing chain a vocal mixing chain that um i'll be i'll do that in another video we we'll talk about a mixing chain whether you use the compressor before the eq or the eq before the compressor okay so let's continue with the video so after recording the vocals with the auto tune and then the c1 gate i start by um, adding eq i start by adding eq to the song so early uh, morning where i wake up on the first thing where i link up so i use the fab filter pro q3 eq to um um, add dynamics to my um, vocal and uh, I remove the low end the low end and then I, I boost the high end that's the high frequency a little bit and then that's it for my first my first EQ yes then I add another EQ and with this EQ what I do is that I find the very bad frequencies the bad frequencies in, in the in the voice the vocal takes you get it so i bring it i find the bad frequencies and i bring them down so example of what i'm talking is this i'm talking about it so that's what i do i find the high frequencies i put them to rest i lay them to rest rest in peace i put them to rest and then i get a clean vocal like clean vocal then i start introducing my compressors to make the vocal um, heavy and louder yes to make it stand out so i use the file filter pro c2 that's a compressor too and then uh, my threshold is uh, um, at a 
24.58 and then my ratio is 4 is to 1 i have a fast attack and then the release at the normal like 50 percent around 50 percent there i don't i don't use gain on my um um, um uh, compressors normally when you compress you lose some volume and you have to use the gain up to increase the volume to standard but i don't do that so what i do is i add more compressors gradually and make everything go on cool yes so um so early money where i wake up money first thing where i link up what about my baby they sweet me what best i'm okay oh do mommy oh do mommy she be money she for the boy so at this at this point i added dsa a dsa and then with the ds i use two dss so the first one i go in for the sh sh or the sh 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 words and then uh, i take them off so I'll, i go for the preset mill sh so with the mill sh i just use my ears i use my ears a lot yeah i trust my ears so i use my ears to find the bad harsh words and then i soften them Early morning where I wake up Money first thing where I link up Mok back by mok bay they sweet me Mok back by say mok bay oh do mommy Oh do mommy She be money sure for the boy But no peace for the boy So you can hear when you sure for the boy When you sure for the boy Yeah we are softening all that So after that I add my um, second compressor which is a CLA 2A A very good compressor I put my gain to 40 and my peak reduction to um 70 and then it makes the vocal mm, yeah early morning where i wake up money first thing where i link up what about my baby they sweet so my second um dsa i go in for the full mix or sometimes i just go for the s -s -s, yeah so i use my ears and then i take off the early morning where i wake up money first thing where i link up what about Mok bay, they sweet me. Mok bay, say mok bay, oh do mommy, oh do mommy. She be money sure for the boy, but no peace for the boy. My jah go get them in love. They ready for me your song. Every man and they all do for a reason. Peace of mind where they talk, peace you know. So I have just, I just put off my vocal ad libs. We'll get the the vocal. I mean the the harmonies. We'll get there. So um. Now I go on and add vitamins. Vitamins is a very sweet plugin. It adds a little bit of taste to your mixing. You get it. So um, I boost the highs and then I I switch off the lows because I don't need this is Afrobeat. You don't need the low voice and the artist himself his low voice is not nice. So yeah, we don't need it. So we we, we just put it off. Then I add another EQ which is the SSL there is is from Slate Digital so um, I reduce the low frequencies the low mid frequencies and I boost the high mid frequencies and then the high frequencies a little bit yeah so we get a little bit of taste then um, most producers don't do this but I do this most mixing engineers don't do this but I do this yeah so I add um, what we call the flanger you can add chorus, the chorus plugin or effect, or the flanger or flanger effect. Yeah, it makes it sound sweeter, more sweeter. But it's not every song that you have to use this plugin. Yeah. <laughs> I trust my ears, I trust my ears. And then this is my favorite plugin, my favorite plugin. This is called the Fresh Air. The Fresh Air just does magic to the whole vocal, like it, it adds a little bit of air around this vocal. And I have an artist who is signed to my label, Pontland Records, with this effect 
inbuilt in the human being. His name is Fargon. Go check him out. Fargon is on Spotify, Apple Music, Boom Play. Yeah, he has a lot of songs. He has this air effect in inside him that when he's singing you feel the air around his vocals and this is how he sounds so so when when you are using the fresh air just make sure that this knob stays in the middle it doesn't go too much to the left or too much to the right then i add another um ssl compressor this this is from slate digital and it's called the x comp it, it just adds a little bit taste and boosts the vocal a little bit and then after all of this processing i just put the ns1 which removes all the noise again after adding the you see this the gates blocks the noise but when you keep adding plugins and effects it boosts the vocal and makes the whole thing louder and then you still get noise so i use the ns1 to um bring down those noise and then make the vocal clear in the mix yeah so i send my lead vocals to reverb and delay reverb <laughs> so in my delay i have um i use the age delay I use only the ping pong effect and then I set to the BPM and then I use one is to four, which is the quarter notes like effects. Yeah. And then I use Mondo mod to switch my delay left and right. And then I use the, uh, this EQ. Yeah. From waves to EQ. I don't want the delay to be sounding just like the main voice. I want the delay to only the high frequencies should sound the high part of his voice to sound yeah i don't want the mid and then the the low frequencies then with my reverb i use valhalla valhalla reverb i use the plates then i calculate my uh, pre-delay if you don't know how to calculate we'll treat that in another video yes and then um i i eq the reverb to i use the mid so that i get the kind of vibe then i had this special sauce it's called the x face it's just like the fresh air add it to the reverb and then i get something sweet now i have the sauce sauce which is packed with the sauce <laughs> that is my yeah, little things i add to my mixes that makes me unique that makes me sound like my sound unique you get it so i'm i'm never going to open this folder in all our tutorials yes with experience you also get your source and make you unique yes so that is it and this is what every producer or any mixing engineer uses now there's another question after mixing how do you make the vocal sit in the beat that is another topic we will treat in another video there are several ways to do that. So after mixing, we just export and then we go and master. I use um I use WaveLab to do my mastering and then that is it. Catch you in another video. I'm OG Sparks and I'm out. Thank you. <laughs>